Hi, this time I want to talk about studying. All kind of people can learn from these tips that I'm talking about in this video. So why I'm making this video right now is because my exams, um, my exams for the spring, these um, bigger exams that I have, almost like a final exams kind of in my country is because um, um, it's so hard if you have a lot to read and you don't really know what to do and uh, for me it was very challenging and I just want to give away these tips that I use so for especially like for example I had these um, psychology I had this psychology test which had like I had to read five books five books and um, to be able to remember everything in these books is super challenging I mean I don't know if it's even possible but especially if you have like um, something that will affect your learning and um, I found it really difficult so I first tried to just read the books but that's not really a good idea like um, it didn't work for me pretty good so that's when I realized I can't just read the book and then next day read another book because not very effective and uh, what is good for you then is that you only read for maybe what two chapters of the book like um, maybe approximately like 30 pages out of the book at one sit like one time and then just quit and um, well first like ask yourself questions about what you've read and um, then just like um, make notes of the pages like very very short notes no don't write the whole book just make your own notes with your own words write something like write what you remember from the chapters you just read don't look at the pages and write something down but write what you remember and that's how you know how well you read the pages and don't read anymore before you like um done before you're done with the last pages you just read and then keep a break because i know it's super hard to just focus on doing it like remember what you're reading not just like um forget it you can read but you you will forget it if you don't take those breaks and um then is this thing like i know 2019 a lot of books are not like physical books i have my other subjects that have the books online and what comes to the books online it's very hard to you know focus on the books online because you have everything you have the laptop you can do whatever you want on that like just click and there's something else like so i get it it's super hard for example i do it all the time i read the book online then i'm like huh I get some idea then I google something else like on another page I open a new window and um, I'll just type something else then I'll come back and I realize that I just um, used like so much time wasted so much time on something stupid so what I recommend if you have this problem is just go to your library and look for like actual physical books for the thing you're studying about because like 
they probably have it, whatever you're reading, they probably have some kind of books related to it. It doesn't, like, it's always helping you, you know. The books, maybe it's not the exact same book, but you know, it will have, like, the same things, probably, and the same things. Like, for example, if I had this, um, I have this English study, because uh, English is not my first language. I have the English books online, but I got uh, a book, grammar book, from the store. And I use it a lot more, because I didn't know how to focus on just reading the online books. And it really helped me to learn. Because when you have the book and, you know, if you just put your phone away, like, put it to another, like, um, room when you're studying, then you're not checking it all the time. Shut down the laptop and have the book. It's so much better. Another important thing is to make a plan, because that's where I went wrong. I didn't make a plan for my studies. I just was like, I'm reading when I want to read. I'm reading now. And um, when I didn't want to read, then I just didn't read. Um, it didn't really work out well. So really make the plans that you're going to read like this many pages today and that tomorrow. And you know, just do it. It's gonna make your learning so much easier. I just wanna say that um, if you make notes, I sometimes write notes, but you know, only keep them short and um, highlight all the import very, very, very important stuff with your pen. You will remember the, the things better. And in the end, I just wanna say, do not expect more of yourself than you're capable of doing like um do not just do your best and then you can be happy with the results no matter how did it go just be happy because you've done your best it's your best your personal best and you know you are good enough just being of like who you are I had a long time, I had this, I wanted to be smart. I wanted to be so smart and get the best grades, but you know, maybe you're not good at school, maybe, but you can be good at sports or anything else like cooking. Just do what you like, really. See you later. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye. Love yourself.